Class 1A stands with their friend Yuga, but his parents claim there will be consequences for lying to All for One. So Aizawa unveils a secret plan without letting the Aoyama family know the role they'll play. Midoriya and Ida visit Hatsume in order to get their equipment repaired. Even though she's completely occupied right now with enhancing UA's barrier, she's able to quickly produce some replacement equipment using only her left hand. Impressive. Afterwards, all the heroes break into teams in order to pursue All for One. Meanwhile, the Shiketsu High heroes battle villains in the streets while evacuating civilians. Now, let's go over part one of Aizawa's plan to battle All for One. We need to keep Shigaraki and AFO at least 10 kilometers apart to disrupt their connection. Doing that should be a simple matter of separating and crushing the entire enemy's main force. So easy. The heroes will use Yuga to lure out AFO. This is assuming Yuga can muster the courage to uproot the seeds of fear planted in him and embrace the outstretched hands of his friends. 